Isaac, welcome back to Mechanical Mastery Plus. Hey, man, welcome. welcome. We're back. Our house is in order. Oh, oh, our house. Isaac, our house is in order. House of the Mechanical Mastery Dragon, dragon Plus yeah, is house back. House of the Mechanical Dragon is back. Oh. And maybe, just maybe, Isaac, this actually, actually, <laughs> actually this time, truly this time. For real. Promise, not this episode. <laughs> Mine. Maybe not this episode, but within this session of two episodes, maybe <laughs> we might such just an extreme ultimate. caveat that it does not even matter at all. Maybe just maybe asterisk asterisk <laughs> disclaimer. We might just automate the yellow essence. Oh uh, yeah, we automated the the blue mechanical essence, Nick, like seven episodes ago. <laughs> yeah, we and did. We've, uh, we did. we've just it been costing, but. We have set up a good infrastructure, right? We've got we have. our centralized ore processing now. We've got a better refined storage system with wireless access, with crafting capabilities. We've got a dedicated area for machines for those auto crafting capabilities. We've refined and upgraded the process of making both the red and blue mechanical crafting components. And Nick, between streams, I have uh, done what we were looking at at the end of the last episode, and that was the recipe to automate uh, lava and netherrack. So round Ooh. here, man, I've set up a little system uh, using all machines that we already have. So we have here our mechanical mixer, and in here, this mixes together cobblestone with lava and crushed netherrack, which is cinder flour. So we had mm -hmm. a crusher over on our third platform. We are going to have to make another one, I think. But Essentially here, the netherite gets crushed into two cinder flour. That two cinder flour then goes over into the mixer with the lava and the cobblestone. And that makes one netherite, right? But you mm -hmm. get two cinder flour from one netherite. So basically you get one netherite back for every half netherite you put in, right? For every half netherite you crush. Yeah. And each netherite is, of course, meltable into one bucket of lava. And to make one netherrack only costs 25 millibuckets. And so you profit 975 millibuckets of lava every time you do it. Even, even more than that, actually, because of course it only takes half a netherrack to make one netherrack, right, in terms of cinder flour. And then cobblestone is purchasable from the store here. So cobblestone is bought. And other than that, everything else is fine. So down here, by the way, we have a jumbo tank, which is filling up with lava. Ooh. We got 188 buckets of lava the jumbo tank by the way for those watching at home is super easy it's just four iron and four singularity tanks which are just glass and iron but this can hold nick 1024 buckets nice. of lava nice nice okay that it is jumbo then oh, it is jumbo, well truly man, yeah. jumbo even though it only takes the space of one block its capacity is jumbo it's well that's what you get when you compress singularities down yeah into, yeah, into one true. block space that's true and okay this nice. is set up in such a way that the fluid pipes by default are set to nearest first so we'll always try and fill the basin with lava to make mm -hmm. more netherrack before it goes over to the jumbo tank right before this is general use for us to use as we wish oh good okay yeah this is nice. just like lava that we need to use. yeah sweet and then on the bottom here you can't quite see it but like behind the magma crucible and below the crusher is a storage drawer that holds yeah. netherrack. In fact, if you come back here, man, you can uh, right click on that drawer and you'll see that I'm using a pusher and puller module in here, pulling the netherrack from the basin when it's made. Yes. And, and then, then it's pushing, pushing it into the crusher. It's pushing it to the crusher, but then the magma crucible here is also set to auto input. So it's also pulling uh, from into the, the drawer crucible. as well. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, to yeah, to yeah. make so, more lava, bingo. Uh, to, to run, feed back into the system. The good news is that the crusher seems to get priority over the magma crucible like the crusher seems to fill up with the pusher upgrade from the draw before the magma crucible is able to pull from that same draw if you know what i mean but yes the good news yes. is that this is just working uh, as intended and i think eventually we'll start to back up on netherrack in this draw as well right now we're not but i think we will eventually uh, especially okay. once the lava fills up which it's on its way to doing we're already at 200 out of 1000 buckets so like a nice. fifth of the way there and i think basically all we need to do now is if you could grab the linking tool and link this netherrack drawer underneath to uh, yes, the okay. system, that'll just give us access to that netherrack as and when it becomes available. And then I think I'm going to run a XNet connector and then the associated XNet cable over to this lava tank because that's going to allow us to just export that lava via a fluid channel anywhere in the base that we want to mm, use lava, right? Nice. Yeah, that's the, yeah, that sounds good. That sounds good, which will be very useful um, uh, for those. We don't have to make one of those... Um, 
stonework factory things or whatever we were doing before to generate were we doing anything before to generate lava no were i think we, before we no, were just we were, we were taking clay we? which we were trying to get by like shoveling the ground to yeah. make to haunt it into <laughs> netherrank to then uh melt it into into a bucket of lava which or, yeah. or we could use stone but stone took like a staggering amount of um, that's it of time of, of, of power yeah of energy right. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah 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 that's it that's it okay okay so this is good this is all looking very good and it seems like you know power is Fine, yeah, this ultimate energy cube is going up in energy. Yeah, it's almost full, actually. Yeah. Well, I mean, we just filled up our jetpacks, right? Uh, between, at the end of the last episode, we both did 30 million oh, did. into our jetpacks. So yes. hopefully, oh, that's quite nice. today, we don't really have to worry about that. This is all helpful, though, because if we do look at the recipe for the improved mechanical essence, to make the improved mechanical essence, we need one ice charge, one earth charge, one fire charge, one lightning charge, one basic control circuit, and then the previous regular mechanical essence, right? Mm. So the basic control circuit is actually kind of already done, right? I think at the end of the last episode, we taught our system how to make basic control circuits with this metallurgic infuser. And so all we should have to do is just put down an exporter from refined storage, give it a crafting card, and it will just craft those basic control circuits whenever they're needed and export it to the basin. So all we need to do, Nick, today to get this done is automate the production of ice charge, earth charge, fire charge, and lightning charge. Okay. If we can do that, then bish, bash, bosh, we've got ourselves a new dishwasher, man. Oh, man. I, I really want a new dishwasher, Isaac. <laughs> I want one that that charges with earth, fire, and lightning as well. <laughs> Ooh, don't forget and ice, ice, man. Yeah, of yeah. course. And <laughs> ice. I can't forget ice. So, um, this looks... Okay. So, yeah, so the idea here, charcoal is fine because yeah. we can just buy logs from the store. Yeah, and, and then cook them. them. Yeah, and then we're them. done. Yeah. <laughs> then gunpowder is potentially a little tricky, but we did see that we can use these boom shroom spores to grow gunpowder, basically, with a phytogenic insulator, right? The the tricky bit is making the Bezels powder, the Blizz powder, the Blaze powder, and the Blitz powder. They're all yes. made in the same way, though. They're all made by pulverizing, initially by pulverizing the associated, the like... Shard equivalent. Yeah, basil shard, blaze cube, blaze rod, or blitz moat. <laughs> and the way that we get all of those is via the pulverizing of the associated effigies. Mm, okay, I see. Okay, that's okay. So one of them needs redstone. That's the basalt's one. Yes. So we need, well, so we need lava for the blaze one, which is yeah, why it's, it's yeah, good that we have what that we've now. made before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The blitz effigy needs resonant enders. That's ender pearls. Uh, right. Oh, no, sorry. It's um, uh, enderium. Uh, and uh, yeah. Yeah. Then we need energized glowstone, which is in this pack lumium. And I think the uh, the redstone, by the way, is not redstone; it's signalum in this pack. That makes destabilized oh, redstone. Yeah, okay, okay, they've changed okay, okay. it. They've changed it. They've changed it. The bamboozled does Nick. What well, you can't call it destabilized redstone when it's made from signalum. <laughs> well, signalum does have redstone in it, but, but you oh, know. K cool. K, K come on. Cool. Come on. K come on. K come on. <laughs> Uh, but um but yeah so i guess man it um it depends on how much we want to um how much we want to kind of reinforce ourselves for future improvements in in production speed because i think that the best like right now we can just put them all into a, an induction spot right that's right and so yeah. if we wanted to we could put down one induction spot which we already have here just teach the system how to make the three ingots resonant ender uh, signalum and lumium via this one induction smelter and then just let it work the only trouble then is that we kind of have to rely on this one induction smelter being fast enough alternatively we could just make two more induction smelters and have a dedicated one for each ingot uh each ingot yeah which i think is it's probably going to be better right if this we don't want to just be cycling across the three on top of us wanting to use them for our own purposes right i feel like if there's one induction smelter doing all the work to make the yellow essence it's probably going to be in use all the time. Quite a lot of the time. Yeah. So you want to keep this one here as a general purpose one and make three new ones? Yeah. We can slot them. There's, there's conveniently three slots here that are uh, looking ripe and ready for. <laughs> ripe. <laughs> ripe and ready for more induction smelting. Yeah. Isaac. Ripe and um, ripe. You've, you've taught the system induction smelters, actually. So that's very. Um, have I? Let me, let me request three. Either you have or I have. Really? 
Oh no, yeah, they are there. Look at that. Yeah, okay, go for it, man. I was I was about to It doesn't know blast furnaces though, unfortunately. So I need I to I was teach just about it. to craft a blast furnace. Go for it, man. Teach it the blast furnace. Let me teach I it blast furnaces. It might require the teaching of smooth stone, because that's the thing I was okay. just that we're missing. Um that's if you fine. take that, I'll do the smooth do stone that. one. Yeah, you do the smooth stone, nice, I'll put this yeah. in there. Yeah, look at this teamwork, man. I don't think we've ever been this efficient. Oh. <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't believe it when I saw that. I was like, wow, it's there for our usage. Okay, nice. Okay, also it, apparently it doesn't have to make regular furnaces either. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I see that. Yeah, we'll that's, uh, that's fine. Here we go. We'll teach it the very extensive recipe that is one regular furnace. Good, good, good. Okay. Uh, does it know now? Does it, it does. know now? Let's go. Nice. Okay. Start. Okay, well, that was that was easier now, gosh. than anticipated. They're just, they're done. Gosh. They're done. I was expecting to have to make them. Ah. Oh. So the, the side benefit, I think, Nick, um, of this is that the integral, the integral components, integral components, they require resonant ender for the highest tier. And if we're going to automate the production of resonant ender um, and lumium, right. lumium gears are required here as well, then we're basically going to be able to go on just automating those eventually as well. Get but, all uh, these, yeah, get speed all these things up. Here we go, shall I get rid of these? Uh, oh no, these are facades actually. These yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll uh, export some yeah. power to those. Don't you worry, man. Don't you worry. Oh uh, yeah. One bit. Boom, boom, boom. They've all got power. Look at that. Can you believe it? So I just need to teach it then over in here, the Lumium induction smelter, boom. Uh, so I'm gonna do ingots only, because you can either put like dust or ingots in and it's gonna make sense sure. to just use the ingots, I think. Sure, yeah. We don't have silver. Oh, that's one of the things. That's one of the things that have come back to bite us. Yeah, silver okay. is not here, man. Okay, okay, okay. So we need to do a, a a buy a buy and process for silver. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Is there anything else as well um, apart from I mean, silver? Like, probably. Probably right. <laughs> um, <laughs> let me have a look here because we have lead, right? Lead's on the on the cards. Lead's yeah. Lead's on here. Lead's on here. Lead is done. Signalum is just silver again, copper and redstone. Those copper and redstone are fine. Yeah. Yes, we automated those previously, right? We have those. Yes, yes, we have. Yeah. yeah. So that's fine. Let me just make sure. For some reason, the um, refined storage system here isn't putting the right number of items in. When I shift click the recipe, that's fine. I can uh, I can tweak it. Boom. And then finally, enderium. 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 Ender. Enderium. <laughs> Uh, okay, Endirium, means... Ian Diarium, Ian sounds a bit like diarrhea, man. Yeah, that, and my, yeah, my yeah. diary, um, my diary, um, um. <laughs> <laughs> that one's like ender pearls and some other crap, right? What, what, what else is? Uh... This is diamond dust, lead, and ender endire pearls, endire pearls. Yeah, okay, that's fine as well, isn't it? That's um, although did we ever? Go back to re. We we've turned on both systems on the mob killing machine, right? So both that's, should be correct. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So that's fine then. That's fine. So 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 that's that's not going to be. A what was it you're worried about? Oh, ender pearls. And I was going to say, is our ender pearls coming in? But they are. If if both the juice and the drops are coming in from the the mob masher and the and the. And the mob other killer thing from the other mod. Uh, industrial foregoing. Um, okay, so that's good. That's good. Shall I... Where should we... Shall I, like, branch off the back of our ingots area to make silver? Yeah, I think... Just mirror maybe the middle one here. Exactly. Yeah. I think we just need another washing factory, another fermentation station, another fluid sieving machine, another redstone furnace. If we can okay. add that to the back of one of the pre-existing ones, then we're going to be good to go. Sounds good. Okay, let me let me So, let me I guess you asked what else might need doing. Yes. Um, uranium? Okay. Osmium? Yeah. And I think that's it. I'm looking at the raw ores here. There's copper, iron, gold, lead, nickel, tin, and zinc, which I think we already have. I think we have those seven down, right? And then after that, there's silver, osmium, and who's uranium? Right. And that's that. So I think there's three, three, three more. more. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I'll, 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 I'll. But we taught the, um, we taught the system how to make the machine bits right the machine frames yeah so i think this actually might be um this might be quite straightforward actually okay now in terms of dormant effigies 
we need to teach our system how to make the dormant effigies right, which are bone blocks and skeleton skulls. Thankfully, all of this seems pretty straightforward. Bone blocks are just bone meal. Bone meal, of course, is just bones. We could pulverize the bones, but I don't know if it's worth it, man. Pulverizing the bones gets you four bone meal instead of three, but it's such a small increase. Yeah. And we can just yeah. buy bones. Yeah, that's it. If we can buy bones, man, like, we, we're, I mean, we're, we're, we're over 25 mil. Man, and counting. Like we we are we are pulling the funds in. That's true. Isaac. Yeah, no, we are. Yeah, we are really we're really pulling in. So so don't don't you worry, Isaac. You but you buy whatever the hell Isaac, buy whatever the hell you want to. <laughs> don't you worry, man, I will. It, you 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 eat your heart <laughs> out, dude. It, you you enjoy Isaac. Right. You wow. freaking don't don't let anyone tell you that you can't buy whatever you want. All right. I'm not used to this much freedom, man. Yeah, how do you like it? I I love it, man. We've already got eleven hundred bones in the system, but I'm still gonna set up a little. Um, I'm basically setting up a draw with a buyer, and we're gonna link it to the system, much like we've done for like redstone and stuff, so that we just always have bones, yeah. right? And then we just buy more if we need them, as opposed to relying on our mob farm to continually provide for us. You know, what I mean, we've got an, ex an exit strategy, man. What if our mob farm leaves us or disappoints us or has a bad year? You know, very prepared. Exactly, man. man exactly. I want to be unprepared for such a. Such a disastrous and scary possibility. Um, yeah, like possibility, which is you know, like you uh, d don't you, don't scare me, <laughs> Isaac. Don't scare me like that. I'll try not to, man. I'll try not to. That's working. Uh, good. So we have bones. Uh, so 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 so. In terms of t teaching these dormant effigies, the craft itself easy enough to do that. The bone blocks also easy enough to do that. I'm just gonna teach you how to turn bones into bone meal. That's fine. The only slightly tricky part is we need to teach it skeleton skulls. Again, we do, I think, have no skeleton skulls. Interesting. Uh, skeleton skulls has already been taught. Had I already taught you how to make bones and stuff as well? Had I, I don't know. Have I done all this? I have done all this. I'm losing my mind. Holy cow. Let, let me take these out. <laughs> yeah, dude, I um, I just requested the thing again, and it, it's asking me for pity machine frames. And I thought we'd taught the system pity machine frames, but I just looked in the thing, and it's uh, pity machine frames aren't there. So No, that sounds right, man. Honestly, I think we probably, oh, fair enough, then. probably had them. <laughs> Yeah, oh, let me um, it. Here we go. Oh no, there is a pit machine for in here. No, I just put that in. Oh, I okay. Just, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> here we go. Sense. Craft. Make me some advanced machine frames. There we go. Black dye is what we need. Black dye. Because mm. black dye is required to make the dominant effigy. A skeleton skull is made with bone blocks. Basic mechanical essence. Black dye. So, basic mechanical essence. I don't think is like readily available to the system. Right. No, I, I think it goes straight. Straight to straight an arrow. yeah, where it needs to go to to be turned into the next tier of, you noticed, of mechanical. If you check the system, you type in mechanical. Yeah. Have you noticed how we've got two different types of basic mechanical crystal? Oh yeah, one that was modified six days ago by gaming on caffeine, and one that was mo last modified twenty eight seconds ago by gaming on caffeine. Oh, mine says sixteen seconds ago, seventeen. Huh. Oh. What if I take those out and put the mech in? Nope, that still goes it goes somewhere. They, they both goes to separate places. <laughs> Nick. I'm gonna sell the, the the eleven stack. Yeah, maybe that the those eleven is what we what we got as quest rewards and not what we like made manufactured. Yeah, maybe there's are. like a slight difference in their um in their in their vibe. etymologies. Isaac, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a vibe. <laughs> uh, okay, I need this many simple machine frames, and I need this many machine frames. Simple machine frames. What did they ever do to be to be referred to as simple, Nick? So so simple, yeah. They're just they're just a bit. They're simple. They're wooden. They're thick, Isaac. They're they all they're, sound like positive qualities to me. Yeah, yeah. That, they are Isaac. That's why they're so simple. I mean, they all simple, sound like qualities that, that refer to way. me as well. Like, come on now. What's what's going on here? <laughs> uh, I mean, uh, Isaac. You know, simple is better. All right. That's true. You yeah. you keep telling yourself that as well. <laughs> simple is better. Well, what's the opposite of simple? Is it uh, is it complicated? Yeah, which is that which is which is worse. not good. Yeah, that's what Isaac. I'm saying, yeah, that's yeah. What I'm I would I, I would argue that's uh, complicated. Yeah, is never right. good. Avril Lavigne, why you gotta go make things so complicated? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Did she never answer that question? Well, she was asking it to the person, and I guess they never answered. They it. never Ooh. answered it. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I mean, you know. Good riddance, Isaac. Good riddance. Okay, I've set us up in such a way that we now have access to, like, I've I've buffered the basic mechanical essence here, 
Okay, so we've got access to some. That's correct. Yes. Nice. Does the production of iron ingots come in fast enough? I don't think so. I think iron ingots are not coming in fast enough. That's correct. Um, that is because we are out of liquid meat. Let me go check what's going on. Ah, uh, right. Yeah, no, our uh, our uh, LLMs over here, Nick. Oh, yeah, liquid we're meat. out of pink slime in the pink slime dissolution chamber as well. Actually, I assume that's the yeah. I think it's to automatically. I think it's our decision, Nick, to re-engage to combine the 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 grinder. Right. Okay. So the com the combining of of the two types of mob destruction is causing issue. Yeah, is is problematic, Nick, as uh, as the kids would say. Okay. Well, I'm gonna temporarily fix the issue by turning off the redstone signal for the grinder. What's up, man? I've just I just came over here and there seems to be a missing material stoneworks factory. That's correct. That, that one's that one's stolen on purpose. It. Yeah, it's yeah, over here. I'm making. Yeah. Okay, uh, hold on. Making sand Luckily, I've made some. In uh, like previous episodes, it's a buffer. It, it, it doesn't matter though, right? Like we don't. I mean, uh, the system's working fine without it. I guess you can put it down if you want, but yeah, yeah, I'll put, I'll, I'll put it because I guess all of these other ones are actually supply. This is like a global supply, actually, isn't it? I'll I'll put one down to look pretty, and I'll set it up in a minute. I am rapidly increasing our mob production to hopefully, uh, you know, for, for reinstate the pink slime buffer and and liquid meat buffer that we had previously, and and all other things. Okay. That's good, because we're going to start using that stuff. We're going to start using the, the drops as well, so we can do with more drops, right? Like the ender pearls and the bones. Yeah. Well, I guess we can buy well, the ender pearls, really. The question then becomes, Nick, do we need to set up a secondary MF? A secondary MF? Oh, well, see, this, is the, this is what I proposed a few episodes ago. Yeah. Um, I think we just said no. Let's just make this one faster. <laughs> I was like, do we need to do we need to mirror it and then yeah. have one dedicated to um, one dedicated to grinding and one dedicated to being turned into brown and pink paste? Yes, right. My favorite kinds of paste. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know, man. I don't know. Right. Yeah. It's tricky. Nick, it's tricky. Um, I guess I should also set up a little uh, a little a little thing uh, actually, like a little uh, charcoal maker smelt. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna use the uh, the energized smelter from from uh, mechanism, man. Because so we're energized. It. Yeah, it does feel. Yeah. Do you feel energized often, Nick? I do. I, some, yeah, sometimes, occasionally. Like a little energizer battery. Yeah, yeah. I actually bought energizer batteries recently for the first time in That's ages. Crazy. Yeah, yeah. I need I to. Know, I'm a Duracell boy. Oh, uh, I see. I've got both, Isaac. Yeah, I've got both. I've got Energizer, but I, I, I can't, you know, pledge allegiance to a specific... Right, no, no brand loyalty. Brand, yeah, 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 exactly, exactly, so... Ah, man, I'm, uh, I'm, I usually I usually just buy the Duracell ones. Actually, that's not true. I bought, um, I think, like, two Prime Days ago, I bought, like, 150 Amazon Basic ones. Oh, uh, you know, those ones are quite good, though, those <laughs> they were not Amazon bad. Basic yeah, yeah, ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I've never found them to be um, Terrible. A, a, a problem, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, right. Gosh, I'm I'm just uh, I'm just analysing your setup here, and it's just it's it's beautiful, mind boggling. Yeah, thank you, Nick. I'm, I'm glad beautiful. you uh, agree. So, so this one gets filled up with uh, with liquid meat, which comes from the blue pipe, which is which is fine. Let me um, create a little hole for that. Oh yeah, you know, yes, I see. You're like you're really getting you're delving into the weeds, man. I'm really getting into it, man. Right? Yeah, I'm doing some. I'm doing pipe work. Isaac, <laughs> dude's laying pipe back there. Jeez. I'm laying pipe, man. I've become Fucking a freaking tradie. Congrats, man. Isaac, thanks, well. man. <laughs> thanks. It's my first time, Isaac. I'm feeling, I'm feeling invigorated. Yeah, no, you should laying man, this honestly. pipe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well done. Wow. Congrats. Here we go. Wow. Smelter. You were uh, you figured out the oh whoa jeez okay fine. Oh my Gosh. lord. Oh wow. You know, the number of the number of times you can complete an optional quest and get a. Uh, Get a sound of money. Are you ready, man? Get a little, get a little fun, get a little fun ding dong, Isaac. Uh, who doesn't okay. love a fun ding dong? Oh, this is not the. Oh, I see. Oh, 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 oh I, oh, I do say. Oh, <laughs> oh, I do oh. say. Oh, chat. Uh, universal. I'm, I'm, I'm detouring unnecessarily, Hennick, which is not, not what you want to be doing because like there's just we got, we got stuff to do. But like I yeah. want, I, I love the sound of, of. You love the sound too much. Money. Yeah, exactly. Isaac, you love the sound too much. I'm addicted. I mean, can I blame you? Oh my god. Oh I'm my addicted to the sound. God. The sound. Ah! Oh, my <laughs> lord. Oh, I can't handle it, Isaac. I'm I'm scratching around. I can't jump out. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna a demon. 
Oh boy, I'm going to need to go the ambulance out of here, Isaac. Oh my gosh. So the pink slime comes from these like the blue ones that kind of crisscross. Well, there's here, pink slime right. and liquid meat, right? Um, you've not connected yes. these together, is my hope. No, you haven't. No. Yeah, so you no, come down here, you'll see there's two separate, separate lines. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like you'll see here that this um, this this line is liquid meat, which you have pulled successfully. This line here is this pink slime, here and you'll see that here slime. they very deliberately do not connect. The, see, they've got the energy pipe separating them. But yeah, but if you look here, right in the middle, there is a slot right here where they could connect if things were bad. Oh. Right here, there's two pipes right next to each other that are not connected. Yeah, if you connect you've these, Nick. Wrenched them. You've wrenched them. I've wrenched them. If you connect them, though, the whole system is f foobard. Is done. So right, okay. Do not let the do not let the lines cross. So trusting me with this with this Isaac was a bad is, idea, is right? an excellent idea, is what you're <laughs> is what you're saying. Uh right. Well this better here, uh, better hope I don't do that then, eh? It looks like yeah, no, it looks like the mob farm is letting light in somewhere and I don't know where the light is coming in. Oh, right. Is it one of the like lanterns or something that we've put down, like the um, mob, destroy all the mobs in a large area thing? Is there a feral fire lantern somewhere nearby? I, there's definitely, there's one up here. I don't, right? think that's, one here. I don't think that's close enough. What mob is the feral fire lantern from? It's from Torchmaster, at Torchmaster, because it adds, the mob adds a, uh, a frozen pearl. We can, oh, we don't have any ice. We don't have any ice. Oh dear. If we had ice, we could test it. Um, I don't think that Fellfly Lantern is close enough. Okay. But, like, it might be, I guess. It might be, yeah. I, for some reason, I always thought the, the thing on them was... Um... It's definitely not 64 blocks, man. That's, that's way too big. Yeah, no, it's not the it's not the Fellfly Lantern, Nick. It's not the Fellfly Lantern. Is it? Is it just a gaping hole? Well, I, I don't see a single hole. Oh, damn. Let like, me let me go. Come, 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 come. Like, Hello. it looks like there's light in there, right? Near the... Near the, the, the Spawner? In the middle. Yeah, it does look like that, doesn't it? It looks like it's, uh, it's kind of coming from the spawner. Because I've got this frozen pearl here, and you might hear me, be able to hear me go... Oh, yeah, God, yeah. No, and that gets rid of the, the lights placed down by the Fellfly fly lantern, if there are any. And it's not doing it. It's not doing it, man. All right, dude, silver is online. Silver is online. So that's that's that bit taken care of in the in the grand chain of, of, of everything. stuff. Yeah. Good, man. Good. Yeah. Good, good, good. Uh, I'm, I'm proud of you, man. Thanks, man. I'm, I can't believe I figured that out. That was, uh, <laughs> gosh, I'm impressed at myself. Oh, uh, uh, dear. Right, let me move this draw controller then so that this is accessible to to all of these things so that we can actually access the, the silver. Did I put a connector down here or did I? No, I, uh, I put a connector down here like I, like I, I I've been in the, I'm the, now I'm the dingus. Jeez. Uh, yeah, everyone, are you dingusing too? Everyone I'm dingusing. I'm not here dingusing to the uh, max, man. No. Flip they call me dingus now. maximus. Yeah, the same, <sighs> honestly, dude. Okay. All right. Well, we got some Latin in here, man. So, I mean, like, it makes sense, right? Yeah, 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 of course. Some dingius dongius. Dingius Isaac. dongius. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, right. Okay. I While well, you've been doing that, man, I have automated the production of both charcoal and black dye. Oh, nice. Okay. Those are both automated. And if I use the old linking tool here, I should be able to just go boom and boom. And those are now available to the system. The charcoal might not be fast enough, but right now it's all being turned into black dye, but that's fine as soon as the black dye backs up, which should be good. The energized smelter is just painfully slow. Like really, mm. really, really slow. So the other things we need is uranium and uh, there was one more, right? Uh, yes, osmium. Osmium. Okay, let me do osmium first because I feel like that sounds more important. Imminent. It is more imminently important. Yeah, that's correct. Okay. That's correct. Okay. Let me buy some raw osmium and then let me also buy some... Uranium. There we go. And then I basically just mirror this system, don't I? Okay, so we are now fully automated on the skulls. We've automated the production of the uh, Enderium, the Signalum, and the Lumium. I think we're, I think we're kind of good to go, man. Yo. Nice. Like okay. we taught, you know, we, we've taught this, we've taught the stuff. We've taught, we've taught all the bits and bobs. The the the, 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 the most difficult part about all of this, man, is uh, is going to be getting create shaft power to the mixer. <laughs> right. uh, do we have a straw? Do we have that mod? Yeah. Do we have create crafts and additions? We do have create crafts and additions. Let's go. Do we Is have that a... something that's going to make life much easier? Yeah, the Isaac. create crafts and additions mod, uh, as as well as other things, also adds the um, the straw, which you can give to a blaze burner to allow it to receive like lava as opposed to like coal for fuel. 
which means we can just oh, pump our lava nicer. directly into the blaze burner and that's going to heat it up without us having to like use a deployer and pump coal there endlessly and all that, all that. Okay. Malarkey. I like it. Yeah. Isaac, I like it. He likes it. I like that a lot. That's good. Okay. But I we like need bamboo. That so much. I don't think we Do have I any eat bamboo. bamboo? I, we, I don't think we have any bamboo, man. Ah. Oh. And we don't yeah, have we're and, not and bloody not pandas around either. Panda bears, yeah. Yeah. You think we are about bloody panda bears? Lift it up. Oh, so yeah, no, I think that's not going to work, man. I think that's not going to work. Can't, we can't do the easy thing from create. Is that what it needs? Does it need bamboo? It needs bamboo to make the straw. Yeah, the straw oh, is bamboo. Like, you're not to make, sake. not to use plastic straws anymore. It's got to be, God's you know, sake. wood yeah, bamboo. It has to be freaking like paper, freaking toilet tissue straws these days, man. Can we buy bamboo is my first question. Nick, do you think I didn't immediately look at the stock? Come on now. Who do you, who do you, who do you, who do you, who do you think I am? I, you think I I'm think... some kind of big old dingus? Is that what you yes. think? You think I'm just a massive I dingus? Do. Wow. Oh, that like... <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> this freaking jabroni. Uh, can I make red wool? Yes, if we have red dye, which we do have. Nice. Okay, so I think, Nick, that we can get this market and then we can just have the villager that flies down from the sky. You remember this Yo, guy, right? Twee! Plonk. Is he going oh, to go comes the, up from the ground this time. Never mind. Oh, God. Hello, Admin mate. Shop He's a bloody trader. wannabe. Isaac. <laughs> Admin, shop is the, Admin Shop is the name of the mod that adds the, um, like the buyer and the seller and stuff. Like these buyers here at Admin Shop. Oh, man. That's so good. Weird. What, what hey, look guy. at that bamboo. So we need to spend one emerald, man, to get it. Oh, Jeez. Breaking the bank, dudes. Do we, do we have an emerald? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If not, we can buy them. No, we don't I think have we a single one, them, man. Right? No way. <laughs> You're just lying to me. Jeez. Yeah. Yeah, how do you feel about this guy? That, I feel, I feel bad, man. I feel, good. I feel bad. Good. You feeling bad makes me feel good, Isaac. Uh, I need a redstone. Oh, is this just oh, no. bad as well? Hold on. Is it bad? Is it bad? Is it bad? Is it cake, Isaac? You seen it, man? I have. I saw the first season, and I didn't think I saw any more afterwards. There's like four seasons, I think. Now, man, it's crazy. Oh, you know. Yeah, God. <laughs> So and I've not seen, I've not to, seen any of to it. Compared to cake, Isaac, by the end of it. Oh, yeah, maybe. Okay. But I think they can just use any item, right, is the idea. Yeah, they're going to run out of items, Isaac. That's what I'm saying. They're going to have all, all possible items in the world, Isaac. But I also, I don't think, are they, are they limited by the number of items in the world? Oh, do you reckon they can come up with new stuff? Like, is it Riz or is it cake, right? Start to get a bit philosophical. I think just do what we do, man. I just keep reusing the same... Items. Oh, right, I see. Oh, that's boring, man. Whoa, that's okay, just, that's... hey, hey now. <laughs> 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 uh, okay, I've got a, uh, I've got a straw, Nick, from Create Craft Editions. Good, okay, good. So so we're okay. Come and, come and look at this, man. Come and look at this. Come around. Hi. You ready? Where are you? I'm over by the Netherrack production. Ah. So we, like initially we were going to make yellow cubes over here, Nick, but we've 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 outsourced so much of the yellow cube production. I'm just going to oh, make them it's here. It's going to be made here. It's be made oh, here. Right. Well, because now we just we just export everything to here, right? And the create power is already here. It means I'd have to set up water oh, wheels over there. Yeah, okay. I'll okay, run a horrendous okay. bit of shaft. But look at the blaze burner guy. He's just sitting there doing his garbage stuff. Hello, look at hello the, mate. Boom. Hello. Look at this guy. You can't Yo, really see him now, but he's got a, he's got into he's freaking got a crazy mode. mode. Yeah, right. <laughs> And then I just run a fluid cable up to him, man. And he's, uh, have you got fluid cables, fluid pipes? Uh, I do have fluid cables. Yeah, like the the blue fluid pipes. That's the one. Yeah, if you want to run them, as you'd one that goes. Oh well, that's gonna be tricky, isn't it? Um, if you just run one from the side of this uh, jumbo tank here, down and around to the bottom of that blaze burner with straw. Yeah, let me. Uh, I'll set it to extract. You, don't you worry. Oh, you. You're gonna do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. this you is going down it. to. Here we go. One more. Nope. Uh, Not one more. Why would you go one more? Wait, 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 but there's a, there's a, oh wait, where's it going? To the oh, here. Okay, here it is, bro. Right. I see, I see. There it is. Oh, I've run out. Let me grab some more. Yeah. <laughs> there's one on the floor that I just broke. Hold on, I got it, I got it. Oh, got okay, it. yeah. You you plug him in. Boom, there, there we go. go. Look at that, he's living the time of his go. life. Well done, bro. You he's are permanently lovered. Yeah. Well done. He's doing well. He's living life, and I'm just going to cover him up and pretend he doesn't exist. Yeah. <laughs> and so, <laughs> block him in. We... Are basically good to go here, right? So we've taught the Enderium, all that stuff. One thing we've not done, um, like 12 episodes now, man, you made, uh, or go now, man, you made like three extra magma crucibles, which you do now have. That's right, right. yeah, I did. Yeah, I thought what's going on here. This is just 
doing nothing for no reason. So we've got these magma crucibles. These need to go down, right? I don't know if we're gonna put them here or not, but we can put them here, I guess. Uh, boom, boom, boom. And then yeah. basically, this is no longer necessary. This is where we were initially gonna make this, but I've moved it now. So we need to just have three exporters with crafting for cards. Each type of effigy, right? Exporting uh, the, not the effigy, they need to export the, the ingots. Flu the ingots. So the Enderium, right, okay. the Signalum, and the Lumium. We're going to export those to the Magma Crucibles because the Magma Crucibles are going to turn all of those into their liquid into version. Fluids. Right, okay, okay. And then they'll get put in the f fluid encapsulator. That's why we need three fluid yeah. encapsulators, yeah. Which we don't have, but we can make three fluid encapsulators. Yeah, yeah. sounds good. Potentially, <laughs> he says, when we don't have the, the things to make it, but that's fine. And then, and truly then, we will be on course, Isaac, to, uh, to, uh, to for one day potentially make yellow essence automatically. Figure out the way to make yellow essence automatically. <laughs> <laughs> All right, three, the, the three fluid encapsulations were pretty easy, actually. Yeah, oh, that's good. So that's going to make the liquid version of each thing. And then from there, then we just need, uh, oh, yeah, that's fine. So that's, that's going to export the liquid version of each thing. And then we just need to export the dominant effigies to the top of the or to, to any side, I guess, of the fluid encapsulators as well. Again, with the, um, crafting cards to auto craft the effigies. All right, Nick, over here. This I think is gonna work. So we've got down three magma crucibles, three fluid encapsulators. Each one of those machines has an exporter. So at the top here, you'll yeah. see we're exporting Enderium, Signalum, and Lumium. On the back, we're exporting effigies to all three of these. All of them have crafting cards, so they should all be made automatically. You'll see at the front, we should be gaining Lumium, Signalum, and Enderium, because over here, all of these should be online. I can kind of notice that everything but um, Enderium is online. Um, that could be due to, there we go, yeah, I thought so. Uh, that was due to the fact that this pulverizer wasn't configured correctly to actually make the uh, diamonds, but there we go, that's ah. around. There we go, now it's making a Nice. So all this stuff is being modded all the time. All we need to do, or all I need to do here is to actually give power to the new machines, like this, through XNet, paste all that in. And so now, look at this, man. All of these magma crucibles are hey. doing their thing. They're all breaking down the different liquids. And at the back here, we should... Uh, make sure that we set these to input at the top as well, like this, boom, boom, and boom. They should receive effigies, and then as soon as there's enough of the liquid, look at that, we've got Bansal's hey, effigies, and nice. we'll get other effigies, the dominant effigies. Look at that, lovely. So then we need a pulverizer, three pulverizers, I guess, just after this. Yeah. And at that point, man, we should be kind of good to go. <laughs> Let okay. me see if I, can, uh, okay. if I can make three pulverizers. I need more copper gears. That's fine, we've got 5,000 copy. You'll have to see it. Uh, I am just missing a coil, boom, and boom. So if we do, uh, first of all, let me do this, this, and this, so I can hook these up with more connectors to give the pulverizers power. Boom, boom, boom. We'll go boom, boom, boom. Make sure these are all set to input from the left, output to the right, input to the left, output to the right. Auto input should be on on all of these, like that. So I don't know. Is there a byproduct? No. The good news is there's no Ooh, byproduct, that's good. which is that delicious. Is good. That's all you want to see because it means we don't have to worry about anything else. All we have to do is give those guys power, and we should start to get the the little the little bits that we need. Three, yeah, we that's coming through. Yeah, nice. Good, 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 good. And then from there, we just need like three draws and three downgrades. I guess if we don't want to have like a trillion of these backing up, right? Sure, 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 sure. Good. Good. Is that good? Are we yeah, good? Effigy. That's good. I oh no, that chat is, is right. We might need um, we might need a second set of pulverizers uh, and or squeezers actually because the pulverizer. Oh no. Ah well. So because then we need to take the Can basalt the shards numbers. and stuff. We need to turn them into powder, right? That's right. The yes. pulverizer is, by the looks of it, guaranteed to give you three basalt powder, but you also get slag as a twenty-five percent output chance. Ooh. Although I guess we could just put the cactus augments in if we really didn't want to have to deal with those secondary outputs, right? Yeah, yeah, like exactly. Like we've been doing up until now, we could just cactus it up. Cactus away our problems. Exactly. Is the squeezer an alternative? The squeezer is an alternative, situation? but it only gives you two with a 50% chance to get three. So you get less, uh, okay, but there's no, no output. byproduct. Well, the right, byproduct, there I is see. a byproduct. The byproduct, though, is um, is the liquid required to make it. So it gives you, like, destabilized redstone, and glowstone, oh, or not Enderium. So we so could potentially pipe them back around. Siphon that back, yeah, yeah. To, to, it's, to the input of the... Um, but it's whether or not you think machine. that's kind of worth it, you know? Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, more or less, everything will kind of be chugging along fine, right? So I feel like it's not too deep, which 
route we go. You don't think we're in too deep, you and I? I don't think we're in too deep, Isaac. I don't think we're in too deep. Okay, this is working. All right. Osmium is being made, Isaac. Good. Because it is night time. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, I think, last thing, Nick, before we ramp up this episode, I think I think it might be the, the mob slaughter factory that's letting the light in, man. Oh, do you like, think? It, it, it looks to me like the, the, the light is coming from the front, right? It's kind yeah. of hard to see at night, but it looks like it's not coming from the middle, right? It looks like it's coming from basically where the mob slaughter factory is. I think yes. we, so the mob slaughter factory will work through the wall. I think all we need to do is just move the mob slaughter factory and the associated tanks back by one and put like clear glass in the front. You know what I and mean? And then it will still work and then there will, it will be sealed with a I sealed think system. so. I think, I think it will be sealed like, um, like our testimony. Let's sleep real quick. It's still light. <laughs> Dude, something's up, man. Am something's I losing my up. mind, or is it? It's still light in there, right? It does look still light in there. Yeah, it, it, it fully does look still light. In there. Uh, it's not. It's not the drawers, is it? it can't be the drawers. Um. You know what? Nick? There's only one way to find out. Hold on. Let me. Um. No, actually, there's a few ways to find out. But the one way I'm going to find out is just by putting tinted glass behind the drawers. Oh, okay. Yeah, do that. Do that. By awkwardly doing like. Oh, yeah, no, oh, I think it is. I think this? it's specifically... The glass... No, no, yeah. it's specifically the the the, the custom drawers. The frame oh, drawers seem right. to specifically be the issue. Because, right. like, if I... Which is actually good, though, because it mean, those are the easiest to cover up. It always means Enderman can't spawn oh, on the front okay, three. okay, yeah, no, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So you're just going to patch those over. Look at that. Okay, so it's the front Yo, drawers. Okay, <laughs> right. Okay, let, me, let me go send power back to the back to the freaking dude again now. Damn. Via Xnet, where is he? It's the mob Damn. slaughter factory. There we go. Okay, so mobs spawning. Mobs are spawning, are they Isaac. Being, are they slaughtering? Spawning. They are being slaughtered, okay. Isaac. And the factory is factorying, right? Oh, thank God for that. <laughs> Finally, it was the um, drawers. I'm pretty sure liquid meat is going to the left, and I'm pretty sure the pink slime is going to the right like that. Okay, good. Okay, good. good. Yes, all good. of these machines are working. Yeah, osmium's being made. Okay, good, 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 good. Why good, is there water? Good, good, I hit it. Good. No, yeah, the water is... Um, you can get rid of that. You I know. can't. It's logged. I'd have to get rid of the fluid pipes to get rid of the water. The water is logged inside of the pipes. Like, the water source block is in, in the pipes. Oh, right. I didn't even know you <laughs> so could have do to, that. Yeah, you can waterlog the pipes. It means we'd have to break the pipes to get rid of the water source block. So I, actually, I think we could pick them up with buckets, actually, now that I mention it. <laughs> Let me get oh, some right. Okay, it was still a process. Yeah, right, 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 right. Like, <laughs> freaking horrible. There you go. Your <laughs> troubles and worries are over, Isaac. Your troubles and worries are over. Oh man. Ugh. Okay. And then what was I was I doing something here? Yes, I was very quickly. Finally, Nick. I was uh, I was going to paste these settings onto even more pulverizers. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. So over here, we should finally look at this. The pulverizers Yay. are working. They're pulverizing bliss cubes, basil's powder, blitz mode. Uh we need blaze powder. <laughs> the so yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Oh, crap. We we've, oh. we've, we've not actually done like that. But properly, this is horrible because I I've, I've I've set this up cuz it's it nicely It's a 3 by centers. 3 like a 3 3 wide. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can uh, I guess you could stack the blaze one on top of this center yeah, line. Man, yeah. Yes. Mirror it, kind of. <laughs> Could do that. Uh, all right. Well, Nick, we have Blizz powder, Bezos powder, and another powder. We'll probably have to get another storage drawer, another draw controller, even to hook. Oh, to these connect up. all of these up. Yeah, yeah. sure, sure. And sure. then that's, once that's fine. these that's are connected, easy, actually. Oh, this. Yeah, these are produced byproducts. That's fine. We're gonna need the cactus augment, but that's also fine. Um, once let me lock these drawers. After this, we are going to have to uh, export them, of course, over yeah. to here. Yeah, where right. the, the final product's being made. Yeah, yeah, but it should be pretty straightforward. And we, with the export card, uh, we can start to export all three of those, as well as the control circuits, which we can just have it automate for us, which is good. And then we'll be done. So we're almost there. We've got like 90% of the way towards exporting, uh, towards auto-crafting the, um, the improved mechanical essence. But unfortunately, we are out of time for this episode of Mechanical Mastery. Peace. <laughs>